I'm Maren McKay, your Public Affairs and Communications Manager for the Linwood Police Department. It's Friday, October 13th, and this is your LPD Video Week in Review. Here's a summary of some of the most notable incidents your Linwood Police Department officers responded to over the past week or so, as well as some LPD news. On Friday, October 6th, officers responded to an in-progress shop lift at a business at the Alderwood Mall. Loss Prevention told officers they recognized the subject who was involved in the theft and who was currently concealing items. Officers made contact with the subject and the subject began running and in the process dumped two Michael Kors bags under a vehicle. Officers caught up with the subject and detained them in handcuffs and retrieved the stolen items. The subject stole almost $1,000 worth of merchandise and was arrested on one count of organized retail theft, one warrant from another agency, and one warrant from LPD. On Sunday, October 8th, officers were dispatched to a theft at the Alderwood Mall. Loss Prevention stated they witnessed two subjects walk out of the store without paying. Officers located the subjects and detained them. A knife was located on one of the individuals. When asked for their identification, one subject provided a ID. After the correct ID was confirmed, it was determined there was a restraining order between the two subjects. Both were arrested and charged with one count of protection order violation, one count of theft three, one count of dangerous weapon, and one count of making a misleading statement. On Monday, October 10th, an officer was on routine patrol and came across a parked vehicle in a lot on Alderwood Mall Parkway. Running the plates through a database, officers learned the vehicle was involved in a burglary in Everett earlier that day. The officer observed two subjects inside a business there who made eye contact and immediately walked towards the back of the store and separated. The officer confirmed with an employee that the subjects were concealing merchandise. One of the subjects ran towards the back of the store and into the woods behind the business and officers began searching. They located the subject and arrested them on one count of theft three, one count warrant from LPD, one count obstructing law enforcement, and one count possession of stolen property too. And now on to some LPD news. As a reminder, we released a brand new Linwood Police Department app downloadable now for iPhone and Android. This app was specifically built for Linwood citizens in mind. Sign up for vacation house checks, browse job openings, meet your officers, or submit a tip. Download the app now. October is Domestic Violence Awareness Month, and we are collecting unused and unopened toiletry items. The donation bin is located inside our building at the front. Our custody team is looking to hire, so come join the team as we prepare to open a brand new facility designed to be the model in criminal justice rehabilitation. We're looking for service-minded people who work well in a team environment and want to make things a little bit better. To qualify for hire, you must be a U.S. citizen, have a high school diploma, and be at least 20 and a half years old. We offer competitive salaries and signing bonuses for both new and lateral officers. Please visit the website on your screen for more information or download the Linwood Police Department app to apply through the app. We're looking for volunteers and there's a variety of different opportunities like citizens patrol, car seat safety technicians, or volunteers in public safety. There's plenty of ways to join our award-winning team and help your community. Visit the website on your screen for more information. Are you looking for a way to make a difference in your community while being a part of a profession with integrity and purpose? We're hiring for entry level and lateral police officers. Generous bonuses for entry and lateral officers are being offered as well as a great benefits package. Please visit the website on your screen for more information. Professionalism, vigilance, and community are at the backbone of what we do. We're here when you need us, respond when you call us, make your safety our top priority, and work tirelessly to earn your trust. That's all for this week. See you next time.